cool thing about it is a lot of people will buy a computer that they're not going to use any of the features on. So I would suggest everyone, unless you're already a tech diver, you start with the easy one. you got two transmitters and two gas blends. Let's say after a year or two of diving this, you're get, you get going on tech diving. You want to add in a few mixes. To go from one level from the easy to the deep, all you have to do is a software upgrade. That is done right now by sending it to the repair factory, which is going to be located in Florida here. Um, the idea is by... So in other you, words, I don't have to buy another computer. No, you're going to have to pay for the upgrade charge, which would basically be the difference in the computer. So you're looking at about a hundred bucks. Okay, so I can use the same computer, pay an update ch charge, and and be able to have a different, basically a different, a new computer. Yeah, you can go from two gas blends to now you can use three gas blends. Or if you want to step up two levels and go to the Tech Plus, you can use up to ten gas blends and ten transmitters. Okay. One unique feature that these do have for our side mount divers out there, whether using the Easy, the Tech, or the Deep, is they've got a side mount mode as well. So what that does is you're diving one computer, you've got your transmitters on each of your tanks, so these don't have a hose to them, they have a transmitter that yeah. transmits the information from the tank to your dive computer, your pressure, PSI, yep. all your decompression information, nitrogen levels. Right, so let's, Beautiful. let's take a step back. Yeah, they're all wireless integrated. You can pee into one of these and a transmitter a lot cheaper than some of the competition on the market. And for the quality you're getting, it's kind of unparalleled. You know what so I love about this? It's got a transparent, it's transparent in there. We've got three different lights in there. So we've got a, re a red LED, a yellow LED, and a green LED. You can program these transmitters however you like. The way to program them, you see that? That's your charge port. So you're plugging your charge cable in there, that's how you're going to charge it, but that's also how you program it into your computer. So in other words, we don't have to replace the batteries on either the watch or the transmitter. No sir. So we can actually plug them in and charge them up, plug never in, have to buy a battery. Charge it up. So the, the, the dive life on these is about 20 to 30 dives on your transmitter or your computer between charges. Um, if you're just wearing it as a standalone watch, for instance, I haven't charged this thing. I've had it for two and a half months now. I'm on 43%. Oh, nice. That's, that's and I cool. noticed uh, on some of the watches there were different colors on the screen. Right, so that's all user interchangeable. So they've, they've, they're Italian, they like their colors. They give you basically every color in the world to choose from. But if you wanted to change, say, your time there from that nice aqua color to purple, green, white, red, blue, yellow, so, you've got so all So I can actually on. change the, the font colors. You can change the colors of every font you see on there. Wow, look at that. So well, you, if you were backwards and you really didn't want that medium battery to show it yellow, you could have that show it green for you or whatever you need to do. You know what I really like about this? It's very easy to read. Very easy to read. One thing you'll notice is if you go out in the daylight with it, you're not going to lose any of your colors. That was my next question. Can I see it in the daylight? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it'll, it'll show just as well. Obviously, it depends on your colors. A lot of people, if you do have problems reading the small font, that's what this guy's for. It'll make you look technical, and if you can't read that, then you should probably be diving with prescription lenses. <laughs> 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 Well, um, there you have it. We're here at Aqua Sports, the Divers Dive Shop. We're going to cut follow up with actual diving with this thing and see how it works, whether we like it or not, or we're going to bring it into the shop. That's what we're going to do. We'll see you next time. I'll, I'll tell you, there's something very special about these two dive computers. And what that is, when I want to dive nitrox or mixed gas or anything like that, I have to have a uh, uh, O2 analyzer. Well, the unique thing about this is that the O2 analyzer is in the watch. And it's real easy. It's got a bayonet mount style adapter that we can adapt to the, to the watch. And then you activate it, put this, put this up against your tank, and test your, uh, uh, analyze your, your, uh, your oxygen mix in your cylinder for nitrox. And then it'll load your blend straight in there. So if you're going on a dive, put your blend straight in and it'll have that blend throughout your entire dive. Fantastic.